Hello. The weather this weekend for most of us isn't looking too bad. Plenty of sunny spells on the way, but it will remain chilly. And the settled weather is thanks to a large area of high pressure which has decided to park itself over the UK. And here it is as it wobbles into the weekend, the centre of the high pretty much over Scotland. Now it's not necessarily a sunny high pressure, in fact it's a fair amount of cloud. And you can see on the satellite picture here, broken cloud out towards Northern Ireland and Western Scotland, but elsewhere it has actually been quite an overcast Friday with some spits and spots of rain. But through the course of the night the skies will clear and out towards the west with lighter winds there will be a frost, but closer to the North Sea coast, exposed to that wind, it will be frost free. So three degrees in Newcastle, about that in Hull, and Norwich as well. Elsewhere it'll be more like minus three outside of town. Lots of sunshine to start the day on Saturday but notice how the clouds develop through the morning into the afternoon and that same breeze will actually push some clouds further towards the west and one or two showers as well. Temperatures about seven or eight degrees which is bang on the average for the time of the year but the wind is quite strong, it's a dry wind and it'll there will be a wind chill so the feels like temperature will be closer to around two or three degrees Celsius, a wrap up warmly despite the sunny spells. And more of the same to come on Saturday, the high pressure centred over Scotland. In fact that does mean that uh, the high pressure will stick around for quite some time because if you look at the jet stream pattern it's in the shape of an omega and when weather forecasters see that on weather maps, that omega shape, it means that the high pressure is a blocking area of high pressure or otherwise known as a omega block. It's a technical term but basically it means that the high will stick around for most of the week, possibly the next 10 days or so. So the one thing that will vary from day to day is the amount of cloud we're going to get because it all depends on the wind direction. Sometimes areas of cloud will drift to the north, to the south, but generally speaking it is looking dry. And if you look at the outlook it hangs around eight, seven or eight degrees Celsius. Some days are going to be cloudier than others, but plenty of dry weather. And of course it's been so dry in February that is going to continue into March.